Lucas Sports. So I've seen where Terrence Crawford has, excuse me, Earl Spence has exercised his uh, options to do the rematch clause with Terrence Crawford. Now it won't be for undisputed, and that fight is going to is appearing to be at one fifty four. So it won't won't be any belts on the line. And like I said, the fight is for this December, or at least that's what they're saying for now. Earl Spence is only given, he only had, a, I believe, 30 days to exercise it, and he went ahead and went with that. I'm not mad at Earl. I, shout out to him. I would think that they would like to at least have one or two fights at 154, let Bud and Earl get accustomed to it. Let the fight build up. Maybe, maybe Earl and um, Earl will have some knockouts of him. Him showing more power and speed at 154, and even for Terrence Crawford, even though right now he's clearly the one of the faces of boxing. Even for him, he'll be able to to be knocking out a couple people at 154 to dominate in a high fashion, and. You know, the fans be able to see that, but I, I'm, like I said, I'm not mad at Terrence. I mean, Earl Spence, nothing wrong with that. But we'll see. I mean, I, I'm hoping the fight will have a big turnout. The only thing, I remember, I remember Tyson Holyfield, too, being just as big, being a, a huge fight. However, this Spence Crawford fight was so, Crawford dominated him so one-sided that we'll have to, we just gonna have to see. But yeah, I mean, we'll, I mean, if, 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 if Spence wins, hey, everything in the past don't matter. If Crawford wins, then, I I mean, he might be looking at undisputed at 154, he's, but he's also talking about fighting Canelo or Tarlo. For undisputed at 168, and I'll make a separate video about that. But yeah, I mean, are y'all gonna watch the fight? Are y'all gonna order the fight? Do y'all think that Spence has a chance? If if he does, I mean, say why. The last time I had Crawford barely winning, so I was surprised the way he dominated Spence. However, on this next go around, I don't know. I mean, the way Spence took that punishment. I did, I really think he just needs to recover, reset, maybe get a little confidence back. Like I said, get some get some fights under his belt and come back at it, but hey, you know, he went ahead and exercised it. So we'll see. I mean, it's for like I said, it's not even for undisputed or anything. So I'm assuming that Crawford's gonna forfeit all those belts. The WBA, WBC, IBF and WBO at 147, so We'll see who fights for those titles. But I just want to make a quick video about it. What y'all think?